Hi, I'm Mike Rankin, Editor-in-Chief of InDesign Secrets, and in this video I'll show you how to see the real color of selected text in InDesign. When you select or highlight text in InDesign, the fill color of the text is inverted. So when you select black text, you see it in white. But this can make it hard to choose a particular color when you're experimenting with different ones. Like if I apply the bright green 2 swatch here, I see the selected text in purple. So a lot of designers will click away to deselect the text so they can see it in the correct color, and then reselect it, apply a different swatch, and so on. And this is a pretty tedious way to work. So there are a few alternatives. First, you can use the Story Editor. Just put your cursor in some text nearby and choose Edit, Edit in Story Editor, or press Command or Control Y. Move the Story Editor on screen so you can see the text, and then select the text in the Story Editor and apply the swatch. So I'll select this paragraph here and apply a different color, and I see it in my layout. Another alternative is to use the Split Window feature. So I'll close the Story Editor and choose Window, Arrange, Split Window, and arrange one side so I can see the text and then select it on the other side, and apply a different swatch. And when you're done, you can unsplit the window. And finally, if you're using paragraph and character styles, you can edit the style and see a preview of the change. So again, I'll just slide this text over a little bit, open my paragraph styles panel, find the H1 style, and edit it. I'll go down to character color, Make sure the preview checkbox is turned on, and experiment with some different swatches. So there's another good reason to always use styles to format your text. Hey, thanks for watching this video, and if you want lots more tips like this, be sure to check out InDesignSecrets.com and subscribe to InDesign Magazine.